so rational number will be in the form of rational i mean uh, fractional form which can be represented as p by q what is p what is q so uh, p and q are integers where q is not zero q should not be equal to zero or we can say p and q are co prime numbers am i correct yes, p sir. and q are a co prime numbers so anything for example 7 by 5 7 by 5 is it a rational number yes sir answer is yes 8 by 6 yes, yes. yes sir 6 by 1 yes sir 0 by 1 yes yes 5 by 0 no, no. Sir. because in the denominator part it is zero so it cannot be same way in decimal form in decimal form if something is there then also we can be able to identify whether it is a it is a rational number or no so there are two things you have to understand beta one is recurring and terminating you have to simply memorize two letters rt in rational number rt you remember for decimal form r for recurring t for terminating if it is a recurring what is the meaning of recurring sir recurring uh, sir recurring numbers are num um numbers that uh, recur uh, rec recur many times like for example 3.3 uh, uh, 4 by 4 4 4 okay so one question i am giving to all of you please reply me privately okay do not reply to everyone and then i will see the speed how fast you are replying okay now i am giving a question 3.1020 3.1020 and so on so can you tell me is it a rational number or no sorry sensor did you check yeah yeah i'll check up and update so i can see here the fastest answer is by Aswat, and you are right. Purujit, right. Shrestha, right. Sir, Purujit is wrong, sir. No, no. Purujit has in the beginning he has replied to me, not has... recurring. Then after that he has mentioned it is okay. And uh, Amana, no, it is wrong, beta. Hari Kartik wrong. Purujit wrong. And uh, Rohit, very good. you have mentioned it is not recurring so it is it is if it is not recurring so it is not a it is not a rational number is it clear yes sir it's clear yes sir okay so generally students will get confused ki it is a recurring so or it is a kind of a rational number so it is not like next question i'm giving please reply in the form of bar 3.121212 and so on please reply in the form of bar in uh, chat
children those who have turned off the camera are requested to turn on i have to see facial expression for each and every one is it clear if you are turning off the camera i require permission from your parent everyone those who have raised hand may turn uh, i mean lower down your hand if you are unable to turn on the camera please obtain permission from your parent definitely i'll provide you रुजित हरी कार्तिक अश्वत हरीश एंड आई रिसीव रिप्लाई फास्टेस्ट रिप्लाई इज बाय श्रेष्ठा श्रेष्ठा यू आर जीनियस बेटा आई हैव बीन कंटिन्यूसली मॉनिटरिंग योर परफॉर्मेंस यू आर डूइंग रियली ग्रेट I have asked to reply in the form of bar. Okay, Purujit, please reply accordingly. Ashwat, very good. Amana, you have replied, but Amana as a rational number. I'm not talking it is a rational or irrational. I'm talking in the form you have to reply in the form of bar. If the number recur, reoccur again and again, so how do we represent? So that one I'm asking. Rohit, because the number same numbers are repeating. Very good. in the form of bar you have to reply beta rohit sir what does bar mean acha you are not aware i'll explain that sir ha uh, yes i didn't find the symbol bar on my keyboard so i didn't type no 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 simply you type bar on what as a oh. word itself you can type it i did so very good hari kartik you have replied same thing i think before that itself harish you should reply okay probably uh, you have to hari kartik sir i have some background disturbance so i want uh, okay some time you want so i'll explain beta how to what is the meaning of bar how do you represent in the form of recurring See anything reoccurs. Anything reoccur, we can keep as a bar on the top. So this can be represented as three point one two. One two is repeating again and again. If you see one two is repeating again and again. So what we can do? We can put a bar here. Okay, sir. Is it clear for everyone? Yes, sir. If anyone is having doubt, may please ask me. I will repeat once again. so the bar shows that a number repeats a lot of times right in finite times not lot of times but in finite times yes sir okay now for example if i say another question i am giving 3.1212 and 12 can we say 3.12 over bar can we say please reply yes or no everyone please reply yes sir please reply yes, everyone can you uh, can you repeat yes, the question i have given a question now 3.121212 can i write like 3.12 and bar over 1 and 2 yes sir you can please reply please reply privately to me and fastest reply by shrestha then sanvi harshit aswat amana harish harshit purojit okay thank you very much i think most of you have replied those who have responded yes those who have responded yes it is wrong okay we can write bar only when it reoccurs in finite times is it in finite times no sir it's finite times finite times so finite time we can't say we can't put bar yes sir clear children okay sir so how do we find it finite or infinite if there is a dot 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 means it is a continuous process oh okay okay sir in this question and in this question what is the difference here dot 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 means you have to understand same sequence same logic will be applied any doubt children no sir anyone sir i have a doubt yes beta Sir, why can't one zero two zero three zero be a a a recurring decimal? Ah, uh, where it is? Which number is recurring? Zero. Yes, sir. 
zero should be recurring again and again on the fixed either fixed number should also recur on that okay sir if it is 10 10 10 then it is a recurring Re uh, recurring number sir got it yes sir okay anybody else okay one more question i am asking beta see in the decimal form you all have understood so here i have mentioned 4.1222 dot 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 means which is recurring in this sir uh, one two in this question no not one two which is reoccurring yes sir I two is occurring again and two. again yes sir two so bar should be on which number on two 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 very good next is if you see the next question three point two six two six two six and dot 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 means which number is recurring beta Sir, two six. Two six. Very good. So we should keep a bar over two six. Yes, sir. Similarly, five point one three six nine bar over nine. Yes, sir. Bar over nine. Any doubt, children? Anyone is having doubt? No, sir. And please understand, if I am teaching, I may ask your notebook also. Are you solving on your notebook or not? Generally, in online, the tendency for the children is what they will listen very. Uh, uh they will listen in a very calm way they will not write so you people should not be part of them you have to write on your notebook i may ask how you are solving don't say sir i was solving in my brain so such excuses i don't like whatever it is being taught you okay. have a habit of writing habit is it clear yes sir and since you all are in i mean already you have completed your previous standards so now you increase daily basis writing habit at least 30 pages you should solve daily 30 pages daily you have to write is it clear 30 pages not for chanakya tutorial 30 pages it could be from your school homework from chanakya homework your total writing all together 30 pages and it should be at least a4 size big register notebook not small there could be a different kind of a notebooks and have a, at least a two colors of pen okay so one highlighting something something you if you have those things you should put a mark sir do we write the definitions that you show like the notes for the class yeah anything see i want you to have a writing habit of 30 pages okay sir either it could be a definition it could be a notes it could be a homework anything all together i take classes for senior students also those who are for j 11th 12th and those who have completed if i ask beta how many pages you are doing so some answer sincerely those who are sincere they may say sir 3 to 4 pages so 3 to 4 pages means chances of success will be less okay so since you all are going for a fighting at national level so have a more practice more writing habit i'm not telling you to have study 24 hours no you enjoy as well you play your game but whenever you are studying be focused in a focus style you have to study okay now coming back to that there is one more question i have asked 4.121314 and so on is it a rational number no sir because the numbers are not recurring very good it is not a rational number 4.2 4.2 yes, sir because it because it's terminating it is terminating so terminating, terminating means it stops at somewhere is it clear yes sir it is terminating terminating means again rational number root 3 sir no no so if we are getting a perfect square root then it is a rational number otherwise no so root 3 is not a rational number root 4 root 4 yes yes root 5 no yeah no sir root 6 no root 7 no root 8 No, no root 10 yes root 9 yes no, root 10 no no sir i'm asking one question please reply root 121 is it a rational number root 121 is it a yes. rational number please reply privately okay sir sir can you repeat root 121 is it a rational number
everyone if you are not aware tell me sir i didn't understand can you explain once again i don't mind explaining once what again is it square root square root 1 to 1 okay sir is it a rational number children you are turning off your camera which is not correct sir can you after the class sir? i will talk to your parents sir can it's recorded everything gets recorded i will review and talk to your respective parents hello sir sir ah. i'll turn on my video in one minute sir i'm settling it once okay. again okay okay so my camera just turns off by itself i think it's because of the internet okay sir can you check your whatsapp sir my mom sent a message okay okay i will check up now uh, i received the reply who is right who is wrong that also i'll tell you uh, sanvi sanvi where are you beta sanvi you mentioned no? yeah why you have mentioned no uh, uh, sir because if we do 16 to 60 it's 120 and if we do 61 into 61 it will become 122 61 into 61 122 into 61 can you multiply and show me how you are multiplying how it is coming 122 one second okay after sanvi please uh, multiply and show me next is uh, aswath you have mentioned no why beta sir because uh, 121 is not a perfect square not perfect square okay sir because 20 to amana amana you have replied beta yes sir ha tell me sir 11 square is 121 very good superb so 11 square is 121 aswath right sir 11 square is 121 Next sir, ask, didn't you say 122, sir? 121 asked. Oh. Sanvi, beta, your camera is off. You are taking help of your parent. No, sir. Okay, please multiply and show me your answer. Sir, I did a mistake. You added right in place of multiplication. You are adding. Yes, sir. Okay, quickly. I will be required fastest answer. Okay. Okay, sir. Sir. Ah, is point six 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 six, and this six is recurring till infinite. Is this a rational number? Which one? Point six 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 six. This six keeps on repeating. Okay, now It's question infinite. from I will I will just write it so that other students should also understand. It should be rational number, right? Because it can be written as one point six. Hari Kartik has asked zero point six 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 six. Is it a rational number? That is your question, right, Hari Karthik? Yes. Yes, sir. Children, please reply his question. Zero point six. It should be. It should be a rational number. Is it a rational number? Children, you all reply, please. Okay, sir. Is it a rational number? And fastest answer is by Shreesha, then Aswath, Pranav, Purojit, Harshit, Amana, Harish. Hari Kartik and Sri Ram. Yes, of course it is a rational number. Why we can write as a zero point six bar? Okay, sir. Okay, beta. Okay, one more question I'm asking to all of you. Please reply. Three zero two five power one by three. Is it a rational number? Is it a rational number? Please reply fastest. And uh, I got fastest answer is by Sanvi. Purojit, Sri Ram, Aswath, Hari Kartik, Amana, 
This is a little tricky question, so be careful once you are responding. Sir, I don't know how to do this. Can you explain this? Of course, I'll explain. You are here to learn it, Silvita. Yes. Sir, it's a bit confusing for me. Also. Confusing, of course. This is little tricky questions. Sir, you need to write 31, I think. Sorry? Sir, you need to write 31. Sir, to the power 1 by 3, isn't it? 1 by 3, cube? I mentioned. Cube root. Yeah, cube root I have mentioned. So it is a little tricky. And you should know. Sir, wait, sir, wait, that. sir. I, I put the wrong answer. One, sir, can you show the sir, question again? Sir, can you? Yes. You need to write one, sir. Can the question again? Once again, okay. And even if you are right, I am going to interact with everyone. Those who uh, have replied even correctly, how you got the answer? See the question which I have asked 3025 whole uh, raised to 1 by 3. There is nothing but cube root of 3025. So you need to write 3125, I think. Uh, sir, I did not understand the. Wait, we have to find the cube root of. No, I didn't ask. I am asking, is it a rational number? Sir, one minute, sir. Can I think and I'll tell answer? This is my question. Or if you want me to explain, I will explain that also. This is a little tricky question. Sir, what is the number, sir? 35. Sir, can if you are not think? aware, you can say, sir, please explain. Okay, so children which I have already told if it is coming as a perfect either square root or cube root or any any form of third, oh. it should be perfectly it should be uh, written as a plain number form, then it is a rational number. For example, we have seen root 3. Is it a perfect square root? No. Root 4. Yes. Yes, sir. Similarly, root 4 means what? Root 4 means we have to mention 4 raised to 1 by 2. Yes, yes or no? Sir. Yes, sir. And 4 means we are writing 2 raised to 2. And whole raised to 1 by 2. Whenever yes, power is to power is there, no? Power to power. We have to multiply in the power. So 2 into okay. 1 by 2. 2 into 1 by 2 get cancelled and the answer will be 2. That is how we are getting from childhood you have been memorized. Root 4 is 2. Means 2 square is 4 or 4 square root is 2. But this is as you advance. So this is the method of exponents and power. Okay, sir. You have the idea or no? Okay. If no, please understand if it is square root means 2 times same number should repeat. Same way if 1 by 3 means same number should have a factor of three times. If you factorize 3025, it should have a factor of three times. For example, if I ask 8 raised to 1 by 3, is it a rational number? So what we have to do, just you see, if we factorize, okay. is it having factor repeating three times? So answer is yes, 2 into 2 into 2. So what would be the answer? Answer would be no. Two. No. Two means no. it is a rational number. So for so, eight raised to one by three, if we factorize two into two into two three times, so your answer will be two, and two is a rational number. Yes or no? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. If you factorize three yes, zero yes, two yes. five, three zero two five ka factor will be how much? Five, four, five, four, two. So here it is repeating only two times. It is repeating sir, how many times? Sir, but it will be hard to uh, hard to figure out the square root or anything for uh, thirty. Sir, thirty. No, no, I have given. See, this is a tricky part. I think in Vedic math. How many of you are attending classes Vedic Math? Vedic sir, Math such yeah. techniques are being taught, no? Sir, I, for me it's showing that I am suspended. 
oh my god you should inform me i will activate it so children please activate uh, attend vedic math classes mental ability classes i will give you permission it's a free for you all why did you attend all these classes no sir we didn't attend this will increase your speed multifold so there is some technique i will guide that also how to find i will i will explain later now 3025 is having a multiplication factor of 55 into 55 so this is coming two times only if it is two times so it is not a rational number clear children yes sir yes sir now i am going to check who is most genius child are you ready okay sir are you ready children 512 raised to 1 by 3 is it a rational number please reply privately please reply and fastest answer is sir i gave sir fastest answer is by hari uh, hari kartik great beta shrestha very good purjit very good sri ram very good sir me shrestha your factor is not correct beta just look into that ashwat very good Sir, I give yes, sir. Should I give the factor also? What would be the answer, children? Sir, eight, eight, sir. Eight. Answer should be eight. Eight. Answer should be what? Eight. So eight. I request eight. all of you, all of you, you have to memorize table till how much? I have been telling whenever I take classes, not only for me, but for everyone. Five twenty five. Table you memorize you by heart till twenty. Twenty five, right, sir? Those who are genius may memorize till thirty also okay. But twenty you should by heart it. Even if you are in deep sleep, somebody asked eighteen seven ja how much? So you should be able to tell quickly. Okay. Okay, sir. So memory should be like that itself. Fraction of seconds. As soon as question is being asked, your answer should be ready. Okay, sir. Next, you have to memorize a square till how much? Sir, twenty, twenty. Square also till twenty. Twenty. Sir. And cube, cube till ten. Sir. Yes, beta. Sir, in my whole tuition, my whole tuition, sir, taught me till twenty-six. Very good. So, if you memorize, that is, I'm telling, if you remember, then after that there is some technique. So, technique, what happens if you know the technique of Vedic math, you can be able to reply squares in uh, seconds. it is good if you memorize till square till 50 also it is very good but i am doing at least at least square till 20 cube till 10 it should be there in your mind okay children next okay shall sir we go next shall we sir, go next can i have quizzes okay, quizzes no i am just trying to understand level of everyone i am not at all satisfied i am asking the question please reply quizzes means simply what you will do a b c d any of the option we will do that we'll do that 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 will be later one more question are you ready yes sir, yes, sir. is it a rational number and fastest answer is by shrestha sri ram hari kartik harshit sir i sent purojit sir i sent everyone please respond i think someone is not responding i'll check up this time 
sir how are you kartik your logic is correct beta i'm so happy sir can you tell the logic sir please <laughs> i will tell sir the digit and so it tell me so they get confused in these kind of sums only like the power um this is a little advanced beta see what happens you are learning see school oriented question sir? very simple you'll get full marks but what happens in competition you'll get trapped you should know totality you know how you are going to solve tricky questions okay sir see that was sir? taught in your taught in your school so can you show the questions sir here also we have revised you felt confident but after the questions actual trouble come in the question sir hari kartik got the correct logic hari kartik can you explain to everyone sir the log sir the last digit of a square number should not be 2 3 7 8 2 3 8 7 8 7 very good very good so okay. if the number is mentioned just you see last number is what last number ending with 3 if you square any number will it end with 3 rohit no sir yeah no sir no if it is not then why to apply a brain we should be able to tell quickly it is not a rational number yes or no Yes, sir. It's not a rational number. A lengthy question. Let's say I'm asking three, one, five, six, seven, eight, nine, four, five. In last, I'm putting seven. A square root. Is it a rational number? Why no, to break our head? Because uh, the also. last digit should not be two, three, seven, or eight. Correct. So we should tell quickly, sir. It is not a rational number. One more question I'm giving to all of you. Is it? Are you all okay? Are you ready? Yes, sir. Sir. Yes, sir. 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 Yes, बेटा. Sir, I don't know the topic of square and roots. I will explain you. No need to worry. हाँ, please tell me, बेटा. Is it a rational number? What sir? I've given one question. Is it a rational number? Sir again. Fastest answer is by Shreesta Rohit Hari Kartik. Sir, uh, sir I gave it. I gave sir. Harshit Aswat Purojit Harshit Aman. So uh, it is like uh, those who have replied no are right. So answer should be no. Answer should be no, because it is ending last digit is two. If it is ending with last digit two, it is not a perfect square root. Children, it is clear. We will see here. Sir, 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 you said rational number. Ah, uh, it is not a rational number. Sir, if it is not a perfect square root, it is not a rational number. For Sir, three square nine, four square six, sixteen, five square twenty five, twenty five, six six square thirty six, thirty six, seven square forty nine, forty nine, eight square sixty four, sixty four, nine square eighty one, ten square hundred. Okay, ten square is zero. Zero. Five hundred. So what what things you are observing, beta? You just look here. One. Sir, here square one. of square one of here one and nine is here four, here nine, here nine, here six, here six, and here five and zero. What is missing? You got one, four, six, nine. So then five is missing. Five and zero. Yes, so these are the numbers which is ending with uh, all these numbers. So there is a chance. Is not always. There is a chance. It could be a perfect square. For some number, it could be a perfect square root. Yes or no? Certainly, the number which is missing here two, three, seven, and eight. If it is ending, means you have to be hundred percent sure it is not a square root. Yes, sir. You, you, you will not get a perfect square root. Clear children? 
Yes, sir. And sir, if the uh, digit ends with three number of zero, I mean odd number of zeros, it isn't a perfect square. Very good. If zero, that is <laughs> good observation. If it is a three times zero, so that could be that is also not a also perfect not. square of some number. Okay, so quickly we will have a glance, beta. You have understood what is a rational number? Yes, sir. Yes, okay. sir. How many of you are aware about the integers? So do I. Sir. How many of you are aware, aware about the integers? Sir, raise hand. There is an option called raise hand. I am going to interact. If you are not aware, you can privately tell me, sir, I am not aware. Can you explain? You are here for learning purpose only. Sir, I know the... Children, please turn on your camera. Are you angry with me? Sir, I sent message. Okay, so Sanvi, you are not aware, no problem. Okay, so yes. uh, let me ask to Amana, where are you, Amana? Huh. Amana, you are aware, Vita? Yes, sir. What is integer? Sir, your voice is a little low. Sir. Okay, what is integer? Can you explain? Sir, numbers which are positive and negative. Only, only to Amana. Okay, sir. I will ask. I will ask by taking your name. If you are aware, beta, tell me. If you are not aware, no problem. Sir, the correct definition. I'm not. Not required. You tell me with example. I'm not here to listen exact definition. Okay, let me ask in another way. Uh, 4.5. Is it a rational number? If yes, which kind of a rational number? Children, yes, other sir. students may also reply me privately. 4.5. Is it a rational number? If yes, which kind of a rational number? And fastest answer I received through Hari Karthik, Ashwat, Harshit, Rohit, no, no, I am asking about that integer 4.5, is it a integer? Sorry, my question, if it is, if it is uh, you would have uh, listened or I would have something else. Is it a integer? If yes, which kind of integer it is? Harshit, Aswat, Hari Kartik. No, I think uh, most of you have replied wrongly. Amana, please reply, beta. Is it a integer? If yes, which kind of integer it is? Someone answer for it. Rohit, you have also replied very good. Amana. Uh, children, it is not an integer. Yes, sir. That's what I told. It is not an integer. Please make a note. 3.5, it is not an integer. That is the reason I wanted to cross check with all of you how much you have a learning. 3.5 is not an integer. So I'm going to explain what is integer. Are you all ready? Yes, sir. Yes, okay, so integer yes, means it should be a counting number, countable numbers in positive side as well as negative side. For example, if I'm going to count here, how many of you are attending the classes? I should not count based on your size and weight. For example, if I count, I will make standard size 40 kg is 1, so 60 kg will be 1.5. Is it like that we should count? No. no sir. Here we should count how many persons are present. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 or uh, anyone have you heard counting 1.1, 2.5. 1, 1, uh, if you go to the aeroplane, somebody is asking, uh, your size is little more, so your ticket will be two times. No sir, they don't ask like that. Correct? 
so we have to count exactly how many of you uh, us are here so counting number if somebody is asking so that number is called rational number and sorry uh, integer and if it is positive sign means positive integer negative sign means negative integer now question is zero is integer or not please reply me privately uh, yes. reply me privately zero is integer or not sir uh... privately beta privately let me check for everyone okay so i got the reply again students you all are making mistakes some students have replied correctly zero is also a integer please make a note zero is also a integer uh, it is neither positive nor negative yes sir means how but it is a integer it is countable because if there is nothing there it is zero but it is countable yes Tell me, it is clear now. Sir, is that why zero is in the middle of the number line? Because we treat it is at a centered place, and beyond that, if you go positive, left hand side you go to the negative. Okay, sir. Zero is like one level. For example, measuring the I mean uh, altitude. How do we take as a reference? We take reference as a sea level. Surface level. Sea level. Sea level. We always yes, count from sea level. How above? How below? We are. Yes, sir. Any doubt, children? No, sir. The last one question. Okay. How many of all of you are confident about integers? Yes, sir. Yes, Those sir. who are not confident yes, still may uh, reply me privately, sir. I am not confident. Can you explain once again? Anyone? Those who are not, I will explain. I don't mind explaining once again. Anyone who have not understood, reply me privately. Okay, I got one reply. I will not tell name, otherwise other. <laughs> Amana has asked one question. Uh, sir, are integers also known as counting numbers? No. No, beta. No, counting numbers means one, two, three. One, two, three. We natural never count number. minus one, minus natural two. numbers. Is it clear, beta? Yes, sir. It should not have a decimal part. Rohit. Yes, sir. Uh, is it clear, beta? See, integer means non-decimal part, either positive side or negative side, okay. including zero. Yes, sir. It's, it's clear. Anyone still having some doubt, beta? Please ask me. And all of you, please remember, there is a doubt group: math doubt group, science doubt group. All yes, of you sir. should join. Utilize that forum. Whatever doubt, let's say in school you are getting a doubt, you are solving X, Y, Z some books. You get a doubt. Please keep posting there. Whatever you have a doubt, please keep posting, and you will have a doubt classes. Whatever doubt is there, doubt clarification session will be there. Uh, Harshit has asked one question, sir. Are all decimal numbers are not integers? Children, what do you feel? decimal numbers are not integers this let me frame as a statement true or false all decimal sir. numbers are not integers is it true or false so what sir can you explain all decimal numbers are all decimal numbers are not integers true or false sir all decimal numbers are not integers And firstest answer is by Shrestha, then Aswad, then Harish, Rohit, Pranav. Sir, uh, sir, I cannot uh, uh, type uh, quickly, sir. But okay, okay. Try to give the correct answer. Should be true. Answer should be sir, true. Why? Yes, I'm sir. Why? Decimal numbers are not integers. Integers. That is true, right? Sir. Yes, sir. sir. One minute, sir. One minute, sir. What if there is a decimal number called three point zero? That is not decimal, no, beta. Three point zero. Can we say it is decimal? Sir, we no. can write it in the form decimal. You yeah. can write, but is it a decimal number? Yes, sir. 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 Yes
What is the definition of de decimal number which is having yes. some? Decimal number is 0 0.3, but you said 3.0, which is also known as 3. So 3.0 is not a decimal number, Vita. Aswat. We can write in the form of decimal 3.0, but it is not a decimal number. Am I correct? Yes, sir. You are. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Any other doubt, Vita? No, sir. No, sir. So hope I have clarified. Uh, okay, sir. Everyone's doubt? Good. Yes, yes sir. 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 What is your homework, children? Your homework will be, uh, please solve the question from your textbook. Which textbook all of you have? Either it could be NCRT book or it could be MTG book or it could be Arihant, it could be R.S. Agrawal, R.D. Sharma, any book. Open the chapter. Uh, I have Macmillan. Whatever books you have, start solving the questions. Okay, sir. And those who have a topper learning application, we have given a subscription. Okay. From that topper learning application, you will get plenty of the ebooks, plenty of the uh, homework and assignments are there. Start solving from sure. that. Chart. Sir, yes, can Vita. I solve from my school textbook? Anything, Vita, from sir, any can chart. you give a link to the website, sir? Topper sir, learning application doubt, link, sir. I will just post in this chat box. Okay, Everyone, sir. please register. And uh, children, we are activating only for those who are uh, going for annual package okay so this link will be there please act, uh, register and let me know your username we'll activate the benefit for those things will be chapter wise notes you get videos you'll get whatever notes are there it is available there videos you'll get question bank you'll get ebooks dpp and many more so start practicing more and more there are plenty of doubt so yes, your test also will be there. Sir, it's about reading. Sir, 